Today's episode of the More You Know podcast is brought to you by CrowdQuestion, a brand new social communication platform focused on connecting crowds to bring everyone closer to their community, as well as enhancing any occasion. Rather than being a social media platform focused on content and advertising, they're focused on communication and connection. Learn more about the platform and download the app free at crowdquestion.com. trying to make it all make sense the more you know podcast today i want to go through the urgency index discussed in first things first by stephen covey urgency can powerfully affect our choices and control our lives it can motivate us to get something done or it can create a rushed feeling that gets in the way of our peace of mind at the end of the day it's important to operate with urgency with certain things and be able to stay calm with other things the rat race that is modern society can create urgency addiction where you live your life entirely with urgency and lack calmness as well as presence but this isn't the way to live life you ideally want to live life with urgency surrounding important things but not find the need to live life entirely with urgency, and this is because it can bring on stress, as well as negatively impact aspects of your life such as your relationships. Luckily, you can get a sense for how much urgency controls your life by going through the urgency index, which I now want to go through. So the urgency index is a series of statements that will illuminate the extent to which you may be looking at life through a paradigm of urgency, being too urgent about life. So for each of the following statements I'm about to go through, score it with either a zero meaning never, a two meaning sometimes, or a four meaning always. So number one is I seem to do my best work when I'm under pressure. The second statement is I often blame the rush and press of external things for my failure to spend deep, introspective time with myself. Next third is I am often frustrated by the slowness of people and things around me. After that, the fourth statement is I feel guilty when I take time off work. From there, fifth is I always seem to be rushing from places and events. Sixth is then, I frequently find myself pushing people away so that I can finish a project. From there, number seven is, I feel anxious when I'm out of touch with the office for more than a few minutes. After that, ninth is, I'm at my best when I'm handling a crisis situation. The tenth statement is then, the adrenaline rush from a new crisis seems more satisfying to me than the steady accomplishment of long-term results. Then eleventh is, I often give up quality time with important people in my life to handle a crisis. From there, thirteenth is, I rely on solving some crisis to give my day a sense of meaning and purpose. Next, fourteenth is, I often eat lunch or other meals while I work. After that, fifteenth is, I keep thinking that someday I'll be able to do what I really want to do. And finally, sixteenth is, getting a lot done at the end of the day makes me feel like I've been really productive. Now add up your total score. If you scored between a 0 and 25, you have a low urgency mindset, and urgency is probably not a significant factor in your life. If you scored between a 26 and 45, you have a strong urgency mindset, and there's a good chance that urgency is fundamentally how your mind operates. And finally, if you scored greater than 46, you have an urgency addiction, meaning that it's more than just the way you see life, and instead a true addiction. No matter who you are or what you're pursuing, there's value at looking at certain things with urgency and not have an urgent mindset surrounding other things. Like with anything else in life, there's value in being balanced. And if you have an addiction surrounding urgency, it can hinder your life like other forms of addiction. You ideally want to live a life where you're urgent surrounding things that need to get done, but not feel rushed about everything in life, and enjoy the present moment. And you can assess the level of urgency you have in life by taking the urgency index. And by doing so, you can then become more urgent or less urgent about life which will provide immense value to your life and make you more effective, along with assisting with making a tremendous impact in this world and crafting a life of significance. I hope this talk makes a positive impact in your life. Please subscribe to the podcast wherever you are listening or watching it. Check out other episodes. Leave a review. Follow the podcast on social media at More You Know Pod. And sign up for CrowdQuestion to ask me questions about the episode. Again, thank you for listening as we propel through podcasting with The More You Know. trying to make it all make sense. The more you know podcast.